Hi Sean, it's Saturday night and um, I just wanted to make this video because I'm I'm really excited because I feel like I've 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 got I've come through some huge resistance about this you know the weight loss thing the biz the biz I'm talking about the business um, because you know I said to you I'm going to do this I'm going to do that but I was <coughs> I part of me was going no and. Um, Anyway, what happened with this this food thing I'm doing, and I'm not allowed, allowing myself to just stuff food down my face, there's a lot of emotional stuff come up because um, I'm not dealing with my emotions with food. And um, what happened yesterday was, like, amazing. I woke up and I felt shit. I felt so low. Now that's, you know, I'm used to that. But what normally happens is I get up, I get up with the day. And also my mum had the kids. So I had, and I had some quite doable stuff to finish off. So work-wise, it was like, it was, this was the perfect day for if I was feeling a bit low. I just throw myself into, you know, just doing a bit of editing, easy stuff. And then I could feel really good because I'd, I'd completed it all. But I, st I couldn't shake this incredible feeling of... It was just so pain. I just felt in so much pain. And I had no idea why. And this went on kind of like all day. And then um, it, it sort of... Lit I went for a little walk in the afternoon. It lifted a bit. And the kids came back. And then we watched Wally. -E. And then suddenly when I was watching Wally, -E, I was like... I'm starting to feel like amazing. And it, the, my emotions like totally flipped. Anyway, the point, the reason I'm telling you this is because something happened yesterday and I went, right, okay, this is what I'm going to do with the, uh, with the weight loss thing. So what I need to do is I need to try out all these ideas that are working for me on other people, okay? So I've, got, I've done 13 interviews now and I've found some of the people in there who are... They're, they've got sort of issues with food, but they're also, they're on the right wavelength to hear my message, you know, because it's not everybody who's going to go for what I'm doing. Most people want to just be passive and they want to go to Weight Watchers, but I need people who are looking to be a bit more, uh, take more responsibility and it to be more of a whole person, life laundry thing for them. Um, anyway, well, I found a few and I thought, okay, this is what I'll do. I am going to, and I'm going to hand pick people, and I've got to make sure they commit. Is and even if it's just three or four people, it doesn't matter because I need to get going with this. Is get them, and to do like a online course over thirty days, and what I'll do is every three days I'll make a video, and I'll get people to be like keeping a diary like I am, and. Um, yeah, I've written, and this is what I did last night when I started to feel amazing. I wrote down a list of everything I've done that I think helps me get my handle on food. So it goes all the way down there, and oh no, nothing on there, but I've got a whole sheet there. And that was just in half an hour, just writing it down. Um, and I'm working out what are the, what are the ideas that are least, um, what's the word... Um, what I've realised if, if your ideas are too out there immediately people walk away so I need some ideas which are kind of quite easy to take on and accept and then maybe some more which are a bit more challenging anyway so I've got a start so what I wanted to make this video was to say to you um, I need to set myself a goal and I need it to be quite soon. So maybe if we can have a chat on the phone sometime next week. Maybe middle of the week, say Wednesday or something like this. Um, and by then, what I need to have done is to have come up with a very rough outline of what sort of things could actually be in this course. Because... To find people to try it out, I need to be able to tell them something about it. They're not just going to go, oh, yeah, I'll do this. I, I need to get a proper commitment from people, so it needs to be like a proper thing. So, yes, that's what... So, I'm what I'm doing... So, I keep on this good start I've made is 
if I've got that as, as my next kind of goal, is to have come up with a rough outline to tell you, uh, where, you know, sometime in the coming week, then, then I've got something to present to people. So, uh, hopefully we can, um, we can do that. So yeah, it's, um, it's, it's really funny. And then also today, I took the kids to the cinema. I was watching um, the Lorax. And in the middle of this film, for no reason, I just sat there and I thought, that's it, it's going to be really successful. And it was like a, it was just like a fact that came to me, rather than me going, oh, it's going to be really successful, <laughs> if you see what I mean. Okay, right, I probably need to work out, it's now five past ten on Saturday night, look at me, how obsessed I am. Steve's away, so I've got all this time. And I've had the kids all day, so this is my time to myself. So I need to kind of wind down a bit and watch a DVD, I think. But, um, yeah, this is um, good. So let me know. Let me know. And we need to have a we need to have a, a planning meeting. And tell me how many of your... I call, is rings, is that the right thing to say? How you're getting on with your... your like, can you call it a picture? Is it a project? I don't know. <laughs> right. I'm going to turn this off now. Cheers. Hopefully I'll speak to you soon. Okay, bye.